will never leave Sammy alone cleaning the house. He was supposed to dust here! Huh? Is that a bug? No, no! Get out of here! What? What's happening? Ah! Huh? Where am I? Ha! Ah, finally! I thought I was imagining all that after my midnight candy cheat meal. Ugh. All right. Sam, is that you? I was dusting. And then that video game. Wait, are we in Jumanji? You wish! It's not some Hollywood movie, Susan! Ugh, there's no cell reception. Ugh. It's good that I know everything about wild nature. Keep it up, Susie! Are you sure? Whoa, Sammy, wait up! <gasps> what a beautiful view! And can you smell the air? It's so fresh! So calming! There's nothing better than nature! Yeah, right. And mosquitoes. Ouch! <sighs> Maybe there's a bug repellent here or something? Hmm. Did you just get scared of this little fella? It's a friendly grasshopper. Grasshoppers are insects with long hind legs that help them jump great distances. Hold on a second. Whose voice is that? Um, sorry about that. <laughs> so grasshoppers don't have ears on their heads. They have ears on their bellies instead. And they make music by rubbing their legs with their wings. Isn't that fascinating? <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, so maybe your friend can help us get back home? Right. Let's ask him. Hey, buddy. Wait. Where did he go? Hello? Whoa! That's like a superpower! Because they are green, you can barely see them in the grass. Sammy, are you sure that we're going in the right direction? I think we've passed this tree already. Or was it this one? Hmm. Oh, Sue. The only thing I'm sure about is that I'm starving. I can't go. Ugh. Leave me here. Save yourself, girlfriend. I haven't eaten candy for too long. No way. I will never leave a fellow crafter behind. Actually, I've got an idea. Uh-huh. Okay, I think it's here. Knock, knock. Is anybody home? What are you doing? Poor Sue. The sun must have overheated her or something. What shall we do now? Ugh. Oh, wait. I got it. Sue, you're brilliant. <laughs> now we'll eat. By the way, Sue, did you know that there are more than 20,000 species of bee in the world? And those remarkable insects are very important. They help plants to grow. You mean by pollinating them, right? A bee flies from flower to flower and transfers pollen from here to there and back again. This pollen exchange actually allows fruits and vegetables to grow. And your honey helps feed us. Thank you, little bee. Yeah, thanks. See you around. <laughs> uh, come on, come on, come on. Do you think it can still hear us, Sammy? We should be far enough by now. Duh! Holy cannoli! What animal do you think could make such noise? Well, based on how loud it is and on the fact that we are who knows where, it's a tiger! They are the largest wildcats in the world. Their roar can be heard three kilometers away. Can you imagine? Hold on a sec. You said tigers are cats, so they don't like water. Actually, they are pretty good swimmers. Duh! Hmm, then maybe we could butter him up with something tasty? Nice thinking, Susie. But tigers are carnivores? That is, they eat only meat. <sighs> well, slimes are not meat, aren't they? Take this and distract him. Um, here, kitty kitty. Look what I've got for you. A nice little toy. Ow! <laughs> Help me, Susie! <laughs> Help, it tickles. <laughs> what a friendly little tiger. You, Sammy, are a real wild nature expert who can recognize any animal by ear. Thanks! 
And here's one more interesting fact. No two tigers have the same stripes. Each of them is unique. Oh, and I wish they all were friendly. This is it, Sue. We will never get back. We're doomed to wander through this place. Ah! Sammy, stand still. Let me help you out. Uh. Whoa! As if I hadn't had enough mishaps already. What now? Ah! Well, hello there. I think this spider isn't happy about you ruining his cobweb. How was I supposed to know it was there? And why did he need it at all? You see, some spiders use webs to catch food, like little flies or mosquitoes, while others use it to make cozy, sleeping sacks for themselves. So what? He's gonna stay hungry because of me? Wait a sec! Look, I found this in my backpack. It is not as good as your web, of course, but still. <laughs> well done, Sammy. It is always good to set things right. to show us our way home. Let's go! Um, hello? Sue? I don't think that spider gave us the right direction. Yeah, this definitely isn't our home. Maybe. There's someone inside who can help us. Uh -huh. Excuse me, do you happen to know how can we get home? I don't think she knows. <laughs> of course not, Sammy. She's just a cow. If I were you, I wouldn't diminish the capabilities of this fine creature, Susie. Cows are known to have excellent memory. They remember people's faces and names of other cows. And they have a 300 degree vision and an excellent sense of smell. Also, they give up to 30 liters of milk a day. So you can milk 10 cows to fill up a whole bathtub. Wow, that's impressive. Yeah, then we use milk to make ice cream. Oh. I'd love ice cream right now. a nice shake and put her in the ice tub. She'd give us ice cream then. Don't even think about doing that, maybe. Who are you two anyway? Wow! Hi there! Is it just me or you like just like me? Nonsense! It's you who look like me. Wait, wait. Excuse me, Mr. Sir. I'm Sue and this is Sam. We're trying to get back home. Ah, uh, yes, yes. You are those crafters. Maggie and I watched several videos of yours. Right, Maggie? Cool! We have our fans even here, Sue! I bet you like crafts with wool! Bass! What are you implying at? Sheep not only give wool, which we use to make clothes, they also give milk to make cheese from. Sheep are smart and have good memory. They can even remember how to navigate complex mazes. Wow! I didn't even have a clue! Well, then maybe Maggie could navigate us to our house as well. That shouldn't be a problem. Finally, did you hear that, Sue? Sue, wait, did I lose my Susie? Oh no, Sue! Don't panic, I know someone who will find her in a jiffy. And they can be taught a few basic commands. Piggy heel, piggy sit, good piggy. Oh, good girl. Did you know that a pig's sense of smell is even stronger than that of a dog's? They use their noses called snouts to find rare mushrooms, truffles. What are you talking about? She's not some mushroom. Susie, where are you? Huh? What, where am I? Sue, where are you? What's going on? Huh? Lizards have been around for millions of years. Some of these fascinating creatures can detach their tails if they are scared or caught by a predator. Some, like chameleons, can change their color to blend with the background. Ew! No wonder I dreamed those things. Sammy? Oh, where is that slime? Sam, we're supposed to clean the house today. Dusting is on you. Ew! Hey! Yeah, no way! I know what can happen after that. What if my dream comes true? Ew! Oh no, 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 no! Ah! Ew! Ew, Tibidaba! That thing didn't throw me anywhere strange for real. Huh? 